Hey allies, Black Myth Wukong is now available on Steam and has already surpassed Power World's greatest achievement of over 2.2 million players concurrently playing on Steam. On the ally, we are able to play this at 720p with no upscaling, with the settings that we're going to recommend, which is 720, no motion blur, FSR as the super resolution, it's 100% resolution scale, so it shouldn't really make any difference low graphics preset, medium anti-aliasing and texture quality. And for those that don't mind a little bit more of a dip, you can also put on the global illumination to medium as well. When you launch the game, you want to launch it into compatibility mode. And for this video, I do have the AMD's motion fluid frames enabled in the AMD software as well. I did have the sharpness a little bit too high, so it might be a little bit over sharp in this video, but I do recommend the sharpness around 40 as normal and also with anti-lag as well and AMD's RIS. So running this at 25 watts, it looks absolutely stunning. And with AMD's motion fluid frames, we often hit up to 90 frames per second, even in combat. Now bear in mind that this is an upscaled image. So if you are looking at this on a PC or on a phone, then make sure that you are only seeing a 720p size window and you will see just how good this looks and performs overall. So very happy with the way this is running on the ROG Ally. And you're not going to have any problems playing this one. It is an absolutely awesome game, so I definitely recommend diving in. However, it has also been added to GeForce Now. So if you do want to play it with the ultimate graphics settings and being able to play the ROG Ally at just 10 watts at 1080p, 120 hertz, then if you have a GeForce Now Ultimate subscription, you are going to be able to play this at 1080p with motion blur off and completely maxed out on cinematic settings. I think cinematic is probably a little bit overkill to be honest, so I would drop this down. I don't even think you need frame generation either. We put this down to high next time, but I just want to show it running at the absolute max settings with cinematic and you'll see it looks absolutely gorgeous. This is a phenomenal game and will hit up to 120 frames per second, but for the most part, it does stick around the 90 to 100 frames per second with that DLSS and frame generation, but it looks crystal clear and there is no input latency at all on the GeForce Now Ultimate subscription. So it's well worth its 20 pound a month if you can afford it and you have decent internet. Obviously there is a free tier available if you just want to test it out on GeForce Now to make sure your internet connection and everything else runs fine, but you do still need to own Black Myth Wukong on Steam. Let us know in the comments below if you're gonna be diving into this game and if you're gonna be playing on the Ally or via GeForce Now. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.